Hi, hello you guys, my name is Elf, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, we are having some fun. I mean, I am having some fun because I'll be doing one of my favorite activities, which is trying out and judging clothes. Because, as a true Virgo, there's nothing more I enjoy than judging things and people. I made an order recently from Sane, Seen, Seen. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I'll put the logo right here so you can understand what I mean. Like a month ago, and it finally arrived, so I'm very excited to get to work. If you're not familiar with Sane, Seen, Sign, it is a website that companies can sell their items on. I think they only used to have women's wear at the beginning, but now they have everything. Like, I kid you not, you can find anything in there. Like, who fucking needs to stock 10 different types of toothpaste dispensers? Why is this even a thing? I don't understand. The whole point of saying Sin Sign and other like websites like that is that their items are usually very, very cheap, but I don't know, my order came to about like 120 pounds, which is usually how much I would spend like on a, my, like a normal ASUS order. So I don't know why, I don't know if it got more expensive throughout the years because I felt like it was super cheap before. I think I was expecting their products to be like around the five to six pound mark and they may have had some, but they were very hideous and I wanted to get items that I generally thought that I would like and I wanted to try out. And these were more around the 20 to 25 pound mark, which is usually like an ASUS design item. And I think the quality there is a lot better. Still not great, but a lot better. But if you would like a video on the more obscure pieces in there, because trust me, there are quite a few, let me know in the comments below and I would gladly do one. There are a lot of interesting clothes in there and it'll be fun to give it a try. Okay, enough with the talking. Let's get straight into the judging. Okay, I am back and I've changed my placement because I felt like I should have an honest reaction to these. I've actually not tried anything out of the package apart from one item, which I've already posted on my Instagram. I was just too excited, sorry. I can pretend I've never worn it, it's fine. Overall, I got eight items, which total about like 120 pounds, but only six of them were clothes. The other two were hungers and an adhesive marble paper. Told you, you can find anything there. Okay, so the first item that I got is this man contrast binding satin PJ set, which is made out of 95% polyester and 5% spandex. So nothing satin about it, but it does have the imitation of satin. I think out of like the six items that I got, two of them are pajamas because I thought that I'll be using them more during the lockdown than anything else. And I just wanted to be comfortable and stylish at home. And this is definitely a stylish piece. I'm not sure how well it reads on camera because uh, the lighting situation is very weird right now and in the monitor it does not give it justice but i am very very happy with it it looks exactly like the item on the image i thought like in this website it's kind of like a hit and miss and you don't really know what you're getting at the end of the day but super pleased to know that i paid for the same item that i received and it reminds me a lot of like the actual satin pj set that i've been wearing a lot on my instagram and you guys have been really seem to loving i think that's like around 300 to 500 pounds but this is like 20. great alternative if you don't want to have to pay the steep price of the actual satin but you still want to look cool also like it's super lightweight and it has a similar like feel to the satin pajamas that i have from derrick rose like it doesn't like it's at all in the body and it's quite comfortable to wear but i don't know once you start sweating how good it's going to be to your body because it is made out of polyester and it is not breathable at all and i'm already sweating so set very low expectations for this. This is not gonna go well. I'm already sweating. Okay, next up we have these black taper trousers. Nothing too exciting here, but I just felt like they're the best way I could judge a brand or a website because I really still don't think that these are brands is by something very basic and very simple. So what a better thing than a black tapered trousers. Okay, starting with the positives, the fit of it I really like. It is definitely a fit that I would wear and I would choose. Yeah, I knew that already because I got a tapered trousers to make sure that it is something that I wouldn't judge on. But now, in terms of the quality itself, I am not a huge fan of. Even though it is made out of 100% cotton, apparently, I just, I don't feel it. I would have liked this to be a little bit more structured and for the cotton to feel a little bit softer. I feel like it's very harsh on my skin. I feel like this is something that I would get in Primark, not even, and for the price of it, which is 22 pounds, it's way too much for such a boring and simple trousers. Find so much better trousers in ASUS design, feel free to go in any of my ASUS hauls, and I have some amazing pieces for you. Not to brag, but yeah, I do. Definitely not a fan of these. I like the fit, but I don't think that the material of them makes them look at all expensive. I think it makes it look very, very cheap and I don't like that. 
Okay, moving on, I'm gonna wear the set that you may have all seen on my Instagram. I actually want to talk about the packaging because the packaging is pretty on point. Like, I love that they, it's one of them come individually wrapped into this, like, sachets, pocket, packets, packets, I guess. They are very durable and I can, like, can use them while traveling to, like, put underwear or, like, just different compartments and different items in each one of them, which are super, super nice. Now, this shirt is by far my favorite piece from this haul. From the moment I received the packets, I just had to open it because I want to try this out so bad. It reminds me so much of like the Prada shirts. It has like a smiley face is here on the front. Actually, one smiley, one sad. Uh, and then the same on the back. And I just love everything about this. I love the feel of it. It's kind of like the boxy fit that again, the Prada shirts have. It's a very unique shirt and it kind of gives me that street style vibe. I love like the diamond like print that it has. I love the purples on it. It's purple is not a color that I normally wear, but I'm very happy to wear this and rock this shirt. This I think is also like the cheapest item that I have from this haul, which is surprisingly because it is my favorite and i think just by based on this shirt like i'll be checking what else they have in stock because if you keep having stuff like that maybe seen like should be a marader now is this a new asus okay moving on we have the sheen men letter graphic flap pocket side wind trousers and here they are in all of their glory I got these trousers thinking that I could potentially pair it up with this look and kind of have like a very street style cool vibe. I don't think that's what's really happening in here. The trousers definitely didn't look as shiny on the website. I feel like having them on is just a completely different vibe. I thought they were more structured. The material is like so horrible and it makes that squeaky sound as you're walking, which yeah, I feel like I already get enough attention with these. I don't want to have the noise too. If that makes sense. Also, like you can definitely see my underwear in this, and I'm just, yeah, not feeling that. Not the vibe that I was going for. Moving on to a not as successful of a purchase, we have this shirt, which is meant to be an art painting print button front shirt, and uh, yeah, I'm not a big fan of this one. I think they tried to imitate like an oil painting, but up close it almost looks like a bad 3D printing job and I'm just not a fan of it. I don't even like the fit of it. The photos from the website made it seem like it was going to be again like a boxy fit shirt like the previous one that I showed you. But having this on, um, I don't think that is the case. This is very slouchy. Also like the print is very, very loud. It is so much more saturated than the photo on the website. The colors on the website were a lot darker and here are a lot greener and it just looks like a big old mess. So yeah, big no for this one. And last but not least, we have another pajama set. There were so many pajamas on the website and they had so many like nice designs I couldn't really choose, but I went for this striped one because I don't know, it felt quite funky. I keep looking myself in the mirror, but I should be looking at you, but I am just trying them on, so I kind of want to see how I look before I judge. I hope I'm wearing the shorts right, because the front and the back looks exactly the same, and there's no tags, like, who makes these? Like, is it the scene that produces like all these hundreds of thousands of products? I actually really like this one. I feel like it's a similar material to the first one that I showed you but it is short sleeve. I wish the swords were a little bit shorter. I have to push them all the way up to like my belly button just so it can finally hit on my knee. I don't know if that's because I'm short. I think I'm normal size, so it's a bit normal size people. But yeah, that's like definitely a little bit uncomfortable for me, but overall, nice little bit of I really like the color of this. I love like all the stripes of the whites and like light blue stripes and especially that dark like almost like green blue like thick stripe i feel like it's a very nice and unique like, color and it's quite summery definitely another big hit and probably like my second favorite item after that amazing shirt that it was all worth it just for that shirt and that is all for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please make sure to like it and subscribe to my channel it really does help me grow let me know what you thought of scene saying chan still don't know how to say it please somebody help I feel like we had a lot of like hit and misses and that was like the good items that I thought I would really enjoy. Imagine what will happen if I order all the obscure clothes that they have in there. Oh my god, I can't wait. If there's anything else that you'd like to see, feel free to drop it down below. I love listening to your suggestions. But till I see you again, keep safe and bye bye.